Hello everyone. Welcome to my first Arduino uh, video. This is uh, I have Arduino Maker Wi-Fi 1010, uh, which has inbuilt Wi-Fi module and also Bluetooth module. It is very small, and I will show you in a second. Uh, we have uh, you know this has a lot of pins here, and also for our, our easy usage, there are these pinholes so we can plug other things into the pin and we can uh, use it LED actuators and other things uh, sensors we can plug here and then we, we programmatically we can access it let me show you the real one so here is the one that I have and it is pretty small you can understand when you compare with my finger size and it has you know there are many pins here and the names are written on the side and there is a other pins over here so there there are two led lights you see this green one shows it is on we have power this is i just turned on in order to show you we will be playing with this one this is onboard led so we will be using this one to make it blink okay so if you look at here, there are numbers I told you internally, this LED, this orange LED is connected to pin six on the, on just over here, on six. So we'll be using that digital pin to communicate with this pin. We can turn it on and turn it off. Okay, let's go back. Uh, let's go to the um, Arduino web editor. So we have this web editor and uh, there you can write a lot of different things uh, uh functions i mean a lot of projects you can have if you used a uh, different ide integrated development environment this is one of them so in this one generally in ide you will have new project but in this one we have new sketch so i'm going to click this one and the new sketch is created for me the word, uh, the name is randomly assigned to us and uh, it has two functions already given us these are default functions the names implies let's zoom in a little bit this one one is setup the other one is loop setup you put the initial things if you and the code you want it to run only once at the very beginning this is like a constructor and this loop it will run all the time but it will run this function is called several times like uh, there's a while loop over here if you know a little bit programming it will loop this code inside this code so it will run infinite time that is a trick in arduino at the very beginning it was a little bit strange to me because i used to have you know java and uh, c++ as one main function and you can run it and it ends and but if you have while loop you just explicitly say that but this implicitly it has a infinite loop so let's start our code and i would like to firstly rename this and i will just delete this part and i will say led on and off okay the name you can give anything so this is our project currently that we are working and it is renamed already and we are connected to our arduino maker wi-fi 1010 which is this little guy on the right here you see so I'm going to just close this part because we don't need this and we can come back to here with the sketchbook over here and I close this we can come back okay so I'm going to close because I don't need to know these are different projects over here I have sketches so these are comment uh, you can put any text here without you know this has doesn't have to be code you can put anything here I'm going to delete this so, uh, firstly uh, I would like to you know without using much variables i would like to start my coding so firstly in the setup i need to tell uh, whether uh, this pin which i'm going to use pin number six what purpose i am going to use what is the mode of this pin there are two types two modes one is output one is input but yeah i'm going to output uh, like i'm giving some electricity charge so our LED can turn on so we know the number is uh, first the pin mode takes two parameters first one is the uh, which pin you are going to work on and what is the 
uh, mod it is output you will see the spelling if it is wrong uh, you don't get this blue color and nice orange color so this is it so i said this pin 6 over here will be my output so the loop will start running uh, and here i'm going to do this i will just say digital write digital write is another function if i can spell correctly and open close parenthesis it is a system function it comes to you uh, Three. so you will be writing i'm going to write which pin i'm going to write pin six okay there are digital write takes two parameter either low or high high means on you know digital is zero or one you know this is high is one and i will when i do this it will turn on all the time currently it is on actually we have this code there so i would like to sleep okay on this one uh, sleep is I'm sorry we will be using delay delay function so it will wait so delay takes uh, millisecond uh, one second is thousand millisecond so I will just put here 500 means half a second it will wait then later on I will be digital writing to turn this off I in the off means love okay that's it so when I when I'm done, let's, this is, you will see there's some mistake. I mean, this here, it is going to run, but it's not the way we want it to work. This is verify and save. And if you hit this on upload and save, it does verification and uh, everything together. So let's first verify and save whether we forgot any semicolon or syntactical problem. Everything looks like okay. And I'm going to upload this into my Arduino. You will see in the Arduino, uh, when we are connecting um currently you see it is transferred but it is always on uh let's it's we are not done yet actually so you'll see the green bar this green is wonderful so it is always on the low we don't see because after low as i told you it goes infinite loop it comes back here we don't see recognize it turns off but so i don't know so low uh, minimum amount of time time i don't know maybe this millisecond uh, so we don't recognize it so after turning off i would like to wait also half a second so it will turn on half second and turn off uh, it will wait while it is on and later on it will turn off and it will wait half a second and it will go back to the loop again so it will make it on so let's the upload and save this to do again our hardware to the arduino so you will see it is again connected we should have seen here green yes we seen it so you as you let's look at in more bigger picture so it is now blinking turning on and off half second on half second off uh, we didn't use any wiring because internally the six pin six is connected to the, this LED so we don't need to do anything you may say one thing maybe I forgot to mention you will see a lot of pin over here just a second I will show you you will see a lot of pin over here but you don't see in mine any those kind of pins right because there's a plastic part it came with it I guess it is protecting the pins not from bending I kept it because I'm not going to do anything with that currently so it is there and it is easy to put and it doesn't slide. So that is the same thing actually I'm using. So pins are hiding uh, inside this uh, this piece. So let's go back to the R code. And uh, as you see what we have done is uh, there's a simple code. We learned this function and there's a loop and pin mode for outputting and digital write and delay. delay. And so one thing I, we can improve this code by putting here integer uh, LED pin or LED pin, whatever. Let's do this. Yeah, pin is better, I guess, because I need the first, because I, can, I may have several pins. And this is six. I can use uh, this global variable. And I can change all this six to 
tin LED. Okay. In in the future, if I want to use uh, change the code and if, uh, if I want to use other uh, LED, uh, but there is no on, on board any other LED, so I can have my own LED. So I can use the same code. And for this 500, it will be much better to have uh, integer delay uh, amount. Okay. So I can put here 500 and I can change this to this 500. That's it. So this is going to work as before. So just let's verify it. So it is transferred and it is working awesome. This is working greatly as you see. Um, as you see, uh, so this is the actually all picture is our code. We worked on uh, Arduino Maker Wi Fi 1010. We can do the same thing with other Arduinos. Arduino Uno uh, 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 used mostly for uh, uh, for demonstration, but I wanted to show on this one. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, have a good one.